Hi guys, welcome back to another plan with me. I am planning for the week of Monday, September 27th through Sunday, October 3rd. And I'm using this awesome kit from Orange Umbrella Co. So I just, I thought that was perfect for fall. I love the little foxes, the birchwood trees, and um, that orangey plaid. It just, it felt very fallish to me. So I thought I would use that this week. And then I have some of her date dots, which is nice. So I'll use those. And then um, I only bought one of the like, pattern boxes. So I'll put this on, I don't know, maybe Tuesday and Thursday or something. It comes with these, which is, you know, I'll use these probably like for work or appointments or whatever. So anyway, that is what I'll be using this for this week. So let's see. I don't, I don't know that there's a whole lot going on other than be the beginning of October. If I only got cold, so sorry if I sound sniffly. I'm wearing some long sleeves now. But uh, actually, the first day of fall was actually very um, cool and chilly and felt like fall. It was amazing. So anyway, excuse me if I had sounded all sniffly. I'm probably going to do most of this with music. Um, so you won't have to listen to me sound uh, stopped up or anything. But uh, I am drinking. I know I probably shouldn't be drinking this, but I'm drinking a mimosa this morning. I am filming this Sunday morning. And so I'm having a little mimosa and it's from my brother and now sister-in-law's wedding. I uh, decided to celebrate them. They sent some pictures. Some of their uh, wedding pictures just came out on their wedding website so i was looking at them this morning and then i was like you know what i'm gonna have a little easy like sunday morning mimosa so that's what i'm doing um sit back and relax pour yourself whatever kind of drink you like and play with me i would be up waiting for you if you had to leave i would wait a lifetime if you were at sea I just want to say that I feel that our love is real Maybe we should hurry up and seal the deal
Okay, so sorry about the background noise. My son's up here, but I have um, these. This is my leftover so far. I'm going to use these um, to put in work when I start work, but I'm going to try to be more consistent this week, but I just don't want to put it down until I know that's when I went to work because I will be trying to work out in the mornings before I get into work. So we'll see how this week kind of works out, but um, I'm going to do some planning on a pad for like work stuff because I also I use this a lot for work. Um, I kind of just use this for everything, but um, I spend most of my day at work, so I do have um, my to-do list are usually filled with work stuff, but I'm going to leave this pretty plain for now. So here's how we have it, and then um, I'm going to go grab the holidays, and we will get those put down. Okay, so I've got my holidays out. Let's see, let's start how we always do with a uh, craft penguin planner. The 27th is National Crush a Can Day. 28th is National Ask a Stupid Question Day. I don't know. Are there stupid questions? Yes, I know there actually are. It's, it's okay. Don't yell at me. National Coffee Day is the 29th. That sounds good. Hopefully, Starbucks will have some sort of, um, you know, special or whatever, like two star day or something. And we've got chewing gum day on the 30th. And I have lots of awesome coffee stickers. So, um, I will definitely be decking out this day in coffee stickers and thank you for your service. I went ahead and pulled out the October holiday. So we have International Coffee Day. It's October 1st. That's interesting. I wonder how we get so lucky to have two coffee days in a week. That's great. And then the second is a National Name Your Car Day. Mine is Yolanda the Honda. And then we have National Virus Appreciation Day on the 3rd. Um, yeah, I think that's too soon. I don't know that we can appreciate a virus, especially right now. I think we're all a little bit too traumatized for that right now. So that is it for Craft Penguin Planner stickers. And then let's move on to, I got my Sammy Doodle, so let's put those in. I have National Chocolate Milk Day on the 27th. Look back. Then we have National Love People Day. Oh wait, I gotta go this way. The 28th is National Neighbor Day. You can ask a stupid question to your neighbor. That's fun. And then the 29th is National Coffee Day. So we are the same on that one. And then we have National Love People Day. That's nice, on the 30th. You can love people and chewing gum. And thank you for your service. And then let's go ahead and put in Planner Kate's for September. We have Ask a Stupid Question Day. And I'm going to put this in here. And then we have National Good Neighbor Day. It's a little bit different. That's nice. And thank you for your service. Uh, actually, I'm going to keep this for the um, for the washi. So I'm not going to waste washi because I don't waste. So, but thank you for your service on the holidays. And then we have. Let's see what we've got for October. We have International Coffee Days. Well, on here, let's put this on the monthly. Wait. Oh, this is October first. Okay, I haven't gotten my October kit, so I'm not going to put these in on the month yet. Let's see. Oops. That's International Coffee Day. We'll go ahead and put that there. And then we have National Boyfriend's Day on the 3rd. I'm going to put that right here next to virus. <laughs> I'm kidding. I mean, I'm married, so, you know. Obviously, I had a boyfriend before this, but anyway, just being silly. That is it for Planner Cake for now. Let's do Chrissy and Designs. Oh, and I've got, let me do Sammy Doodle Designs first, actually. Well, I'm on the first. We have National Hair Day on the first. So that's different. I uh, hope you don't find a hair in your coffee because that would not be fun or make for a good Friday. Then we've got National Custodian Day on the second. Appreciate those custodians. 
cleaning up after you and your place of work. And then we've got National Boyfriend Day. Um, it's a third. And this one's a lot more positive and sweet with a little heart. So I'm going to put that right there. Okay, so that's it for that. Those are, that's it for the semi doodle designs. And then we've got Sukkot ends. I'm so sorry if I'm um, butchering that, but it's my best attempt. So um, actually, I'm going to put this on Monday in my monthly because I did, did have the begins um, last week. And we've got National Coffee Day on October 1st, which I think that's funny. They call it International Coffee Day. This one's National Coffee Day. Um, because I don't have my um, monthly kit yet, I'm going to just put this like up here or something. It kind of goes with the orange anyway. And we also have National Hair Day on the 1st. And then we've got nothing until October 4th. So we'll hang on to that. That's it for the holidays. I think I've got everything in that I want to put in for now. I'm probably going to do some pre-planning later today for the upcoming work week in my, on like a planning pad and then map it all out and decide how I want to set up my to-do list for the week. But as I usually do, I'll add stickers as I go and, you know, just um, fill it all in. And I usually post the finished spreads to my Instagram account. So go follow me over there and check out my Instagram. So, um, and if you came over from Instagram, thank you so much. And please like, share, subscribe, all those things. And thank you so much for watching. Have a great week. Bye.